Welcome to this week's Walter Showroom Update. I'm Zach, and we're talking all about Cabis this week, the international car company's bay window caboose to be exact, a standardized design that was used by many U.S. railroads from the 1950s all the way through the 1980s. So let's take a close look. All right, the international bay window caboose was adopted by many different railroads looking to replace older wooden equipment. The car itself was offered as a standard design, but then the roads could actually customize uh, to meet whatever their needs may be which is why you'll see that the Mothers mainline model comes with one of three different bay window configurations. And you can see those three here. So just to zoom in a little bit, starting out with the NYC short style, uh, short window bay. And then we've got a design that uh, reaches the full height of the side, but only has one window. And then third, we've got a bay that stops just short of the car side height and it's got two side windows and these are all installed as appropriate per railroad. All right, let's get right into the paint schemes then and uh, just to be risque, I'm gonna go in reverse alphabetical order. Hmm. Starting off with Southern Pacific and boxcar red with the orange ends. And we've got Southern in a red scheme with white lettering. Norfolk Southern red with the stallion logo. New York Central in the Jade Scheme. Great Northern with a large GOAT logo and the slogan, Safety Today, Every Day. CSX in this amazing Operation Lifesaver Scheme. And finally, Santa Fe with red uh, and yellow with a large logo. All right, so we'll also give you a quick look at the paint schemes that are currently available from the first production run of this car. So there's a few benefits to the bay window over the previously standard cupola. Um, first is that it was safer for the conductor and possibly flagman when the car experienced slack action. Uh, being lower in the car instead of being in the cupola allowed the crew to brace themselves. Um, second, being lower to the ground helped the crew to see around curves and it also put them in a better position to see fire or smoke in the case of overheated axles or hotboxing. Finally, uh, with the new generation of freight cars entering service, that were taller than standard cabooses, side windows afforded the crew a better view of the action. All right, so that last batch that you just saw, the ones that uh, were the previous run, those are now in stock. Uh, they retail for $34.98. The next batch is coming in January 2017, uh, also $34.98. So check them out at your local hobby shop or you can pop on over to walters.com to get some more information. You can see multiple photos there of the previous run. Uh, we've got photos of the ends and the sides and, and just a whole lot more information. So check those out. That's our show for this week. Thank you very much for joining me. Come back in two more weeks with a little bit of luck. Uh, and the samples, if they could possibly arrive, will have the brand new Scene Master 35-foot fluted side trailers.